Hey YouTube, this is the Sea Past. Um, I figured I'd bring you a video, Nazi Zombies Ascension. Um, this isn't really a strategy, just a few points on a strategy I've seen videos on already, um, which would be the flopper strategy, the pH flopper, that area. Um, I don't like it, but I think there's a lot better ways to play it than I've seen, so I'll just break it down for you. Um, this is entire game footage, so it's sped up to uh, make room. It's down to 13 minutes. It's like a two-hour long game we played, so I just downsized it as much as I could. Um, first four rounds, you're going to stab them after shooting them so many times. In the first round, I shoot them six times, second time eight, third round 12, fourth round 16. And then the one knife kills after that, assuming you have the ammo for that. Um, then I'm going to open up the MPL, go up the MPL, way to the box, and hit the box. Um, if you grab a MPL, you can probably hold out before you open the box area for a little while on these stairs here. Um, after a while, your point's up, you're going to make a crawler and go towards your campsite. Um, don't open that door. Um, I'm not sure why I've been told not to whatever again this is not my strategy I will post a video on what I do why I think it's better but anyway um, first things you want to do after you have an automatic all you need from beginning rounds to like 15 are two weapons automatic I have an AUG and an HK I believe um, after you get those weapons I usually get the teleporters well, not the teleporters the landers roamed around enough to get the rocket launched and then I'll worry about my perks which I'll go through after this um, pretty much this strategy there's two windows and a stairwell and people usually flop off the stairwell and I think that's pretty silly seeing how flopping is only effective until like 18 or 20 anyway um, I don't know why you would do it all game I'm not even sure if you get points for flop kills or if you just get 60 a kill or what what that is, but I just don't see the point to it. So anyway, um, person on the bottom window for guns, I would recommend RBK and a HK. Um, maybe a, a ray gun instead of the RPK, but I think just watching a window all game, two uh, guns with lots of ammo would be plenty. Um, the window I'm watching, I think it's key. Um, you need the ray gun, thunder gun, HK, any two of those three guns. And uh, I'll break down how I think you should play this window. I think it's the most important part of this strategy. Um, I don't think flopping is a big deal and should be the main focus of this. Um, I think that you kill too easy. Anyway, the two people on the stairs, instead of flopping, you should sit down by where they merge into a lane down at the bottom of the steps and shoot two heavy assault rifles or whatever like machine guns whatever you got and then when you have to fall back then flop and uh, that'll keep zombies more bunched together and more at your control anyway let's talk about perks for the strategy then um, of course, the space monkeys, you want to guard them. There's four players, you get four perks, so everyone grab a perk machine and guard it. Juggernog should be the first drink you buy. I don't care how good you think you are, you can get one hit down very easy, especially late in this game. Juggernog, quick reload, and then stamina and the flopper. Um, everyone should have the flopper only because when you play a game like this even if you don't use it everyone is going to have it for the strategy so you might as well have it you don't want to get different perks for uh, the strategy because you'd have to guard five machines with four people and that would just be a little hard so all right you can always you know just use what you want to use do whatever strategy or perks you want to do but those are the four i recommend all right on the guns um I like the Thunder Gun. I like to be in charge of the Thunder Gun. I don't trust people. Nothing personal. Just how I am. Um, 
ray gun or an HK. The HK is good until it runs out of ammo, which I run out of ammo with it in this game and end up picking up an RPK. And then later on at the very end, the ray gun. Ray gun and thunder gun combo would be key to uh, winning this game. Not winning, well, surviving. Um, the reason this spot I'm watching at the moment is so important. If you have to quarterback what's going on, you have to, when needed, throw black holes. When needed, go pick people up like this. Um, pretty much have to just watch what's going on. Communicate to your teammates about what's going on. Um, you can go far. The only problem, like I said, is ammo in this game. I haven't found a good strategy to conserve ammo and survive. Um, those claymores, you need claymores everywhere on this platform because by like 22 or 23 you're going to start running out of ammo and if one player in one position runs out of ammo people are going to start going down and see we lucked out there, I think this is 17 this round lucked out with getting a max ammo shortly before we got another, another monkey round um, so with that fact I just took that time to Make sure I had all my perks and I had all the landers. Anyway, back to the window. Um, you need, if there's anything going on, say there's a death machine way out that nobody else other than you can see. You can jump down and get that. You have claymores around so your window is taken care of. And get that and then let people know. You could go down pick people up, no problem. I mean... I don't think we need to flop in this strategy very often. I think if you just maintain your position, try to use your ammo wisely, you'll uh, make it far. But uh, like I said, this is a game two round 25. Um, we had problems with ammo and problems leaving people on, leaving people off the lander rather. So you see how they're funneling in pretty good now. Round 25, they said they're getting overrun already. I threw a black hole for them. This window starts getting a little crazy in the 20s, but still very manageable. Um, I get the RPK. I don't recommend the RPK for this window. It blows through ammo. Um, it's like the AUG. It's like any other high-rate machine gun. Um, the HK is really what you need. And then a ray gun. Um, this is our end. We ran out of ammo. I think I have about a dozen shots left with the Thunder. Zeus, whatever it's called. Um, everyone else is pretty low. So, well, doing these landers, after playing this game and watching this video, I decided that there's better ways to do it. You have to run and hit fences um, when you go to a certain spot. Whatever. Um, that's all another video. Um, I don't know this map. This is only, I think, my third or fourth time playing this game. First time playing this strategy, I believe it was. And we made it to round 25, which is pretty good for doing anything for your first time. Um, I think my strategy is better. I'll post a video on that next. Uh, so, yeah, just some things to think about. Um, that top window, definitely key, definitely should whoever has the Zeus gun. I don't like having the person with the Zeus gun up front because there's a problem anywhere else or if he goes down then you guys are shit out of luck. I like having the Zeus gun as you'll see in my next strategy in the back to as things start to screw up take control of the situation and uh, downsize the problems and uh, all that fun shit to uh, make sure you guys survive. Right there we leave our first person behind and it just, just goes downhill fast here. Um, if you guys have any questions on this strategy, let me know. There's just so much to this strategy. Like this this spot right here with the lander, I think if you're fast enough you can all run down to where you guys camp. Like these guys try to but get ramped by zombies. If you go lead with the Zeus cannon though, you probably make it. Um, we were just trying to ride out the zombies here and land around because no one had ammo but yeah I think if you run you hit the flames you hit the turrets I think you can survive a lot longer than we did so anyway enjoy 
here the last couple of minutes of our last stand. And uh, questions, please post them. Just let me know what you think. Um, I'll make a few more videos on zombies. And uh, I don't know, maybe if you guys request it, I'll do videos on this map, on this strategy some more. If you need something further explained, whatever, just let me know. It's all about you guys. Peace out. Yeah, well, that's all you, man. The staircases are deadly. I'm even lagging right now. Fuck. Fuck yeah. Yeah, where are you, man? Are you on the lander? Oh, I'm going down.